it's still the case that less than half the people in Africa actually have access to electricity, a reliable supply, and one that's affordable. We focus on the key problems that face the electricity sector in Africa. The big issue that Africa doesn't have enough power and how do you bring investment uh, into the sector. One of the fastest growing sources of finance is now from the private sector. That is a real speciality. Understanding how these special purpose vehicles are set up, how project finance works. Often you would hear people say, well, gee, this private sector, they require so much from us. They require so many guarantees. But without understanding the particular nature of how these finance mechanisms work, and this is really the overall aim uh, that we have in this course. We look at the overall structure of project finance, how you structure debt and equity. There's quite an element also on financial modeling. We look at how you structure power purchase agreements, off-take agreements, the kind of risk mitigation measures that need to be in place. And then we also look at the special case of renewable energy, and that creates a number of additional challenges around financing, which we deal with. What we've always tried to do in our courses is two broad things. Is one, to have real academic rigor to this, to have conceptual clarity, to be able to have a really top-rate learning experience. But we want to combine and integrate that academic rigor with the context of Africa, the challenges of Africa. We really want a wide group of stakeholders in the room. It creates a really interesting conversation that developed this much deeper understanding of how financing works for power projects in Africa.